it's the king king j back with another video today we have lee charlan this character is a he's a very funny character very vocal he knows what he's doing with the just frames you're gonna have to learn the just frames this character ain't easy you know if you want the proper combos and all that stuff you're gonna have to train hard and you're gonna have to watch players like thank you very much for the text really appreciate it. you're gonna have to watch people like Mirio, Mirio is definitely one that you need to watch. I'm your father is another one. And yeah, Lee's such an advanced character that there isn't that many Lee players. But the ones that are there are very, very strong. And they've taken their time to perfect the character. Just like I want you to. So yeah, check out the beginner guide and then go check them out for the more advanced stuff. Let's get into the video. Yo, so we're at Lee's home now. I would love to have a home like this. Look at him, man. He's got a picture of himself, loads of books and stuff. But the only words he gets to say is excellent and marvelous. He needs a better dictionary, right? So we're going to get into this guide with Lee. Lee is a counted specialist and likes to do just frame attacks. So he requires a lot of execution. I'm going to show you some of his moves right now. So he has back four, which is a good move to use. And counter hit launches we also have 444 that has a just frame like that then we have 124 that and that's the just frame you can tell the just frame because of the sparks a down forward one which is a good mid poke you know if you want to try and open up your opponent's defense that would be your move down forward two is to start your combos and then you have down back three, which is a low, which is minus one. And even on counter hit, it's minus one. But that's because of his heat smash probably, but we'll get into that later on. Down back three plus four is a nice slow. And allows you to do blazing kick. For some reason, I'm not... There we go. So you can get blazing kick like that. Two, two, three is a it's basically fishing for counter hit so you know if you feel like your opponent's gonna press then you can hit them with that it's all guaranteed if you can land it but you it's only guaranteed on the counter hit right so let's say for example we've got him on stand block there we go so no more no more no more hit it's not going to be guaranteed but if you're fishing for that counter hit and you get them with that counter hit then it's guaranteed the best way to do it is to see if the two hits but don't delay it too much so something like that is again it's execution so then now you have down three which cr it, it does crush highs and it, it crushes it pretty early and you also get a combo as well so you would have to crouch cancel and do back three three you have down forward four four which is a 13 frame hate engager which i think is so is so good and then you have four four two but if you do it if you do fast input you get the just frame you got Blazing Kick, which is also a tornado attack as well, but it's a big launcher. But you ain't gonna wanna just throw that out and open because you can get punished as well. You got Running 3-4. Free, free so this is your pressure tool, along with the down forward one and stuff like that. Because on block, you can then go from down three, down forward one, into Hitman. By pressing three plus four. All right, so a new addition to Lee is his while standing free free. And usually you could press free and it'll be it'll go mid, but you now have to press down forward for the mid. And if you want to do while standing free free low, you would then have to do down free. So it'll be like down, and then like that, right? So that's how it would work. So yeah, it does work in a bit of a different way. So then now we have 
while standing four, then you can go into Hitman by pressing three plus four. And then you have while standing, while standing one four, while standing one two, which will be in your combo. So you could do while standing one two and press forward to then do the, the, the step. And then you have up forward three one, up forward three four. So one's mid mid, one is mid high. And the mid bid is minus 12, so you can get punished for it at high level. You're gonna go 4-4-3, four, four, that I think is a very good move, which is a heat engager, but we're gonna get into the heat engagers later. We then have, while well, standing 2-3, sorry. This move, minus 13, but this is a very good 13, uh, 14 frame punish, but you're only minus 13, that's it. But then you have a mix, which is while well, standing 2-4, which is mid high. So then homing moves, you got back back four. And then you have one plus two. But as you can see, one plus two being in mid is only minus one. And you could go into her uh hitman and it'll be plus two. Right? So back back four. Hermit. I'm gonna say hermit, hitman, sorry, is plus five. So yeah, you got two, this one's high, and this one's mid. So it's up to you which one you want to choose. They're both very good, in my opinion. You got Mistrap, which I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this. It's, it's three, three, four. So I've got to get it at the right time. Oh, my execution is excellent, thank you. And it doesn't even matter, it doesn't even matter if the opponent is blocking. Let's see if I can get it again. The timing is pretty hard though. I got it first time, there we go. So it doesn't matter if they're blocking. And then you've got slide, which is down forward, down, down forward. So like this. You could also do slide by doing forward, neutral, three plus four. and knocks them down on counter hit. Counter hit on this one, knocks down two. I also, I prefer the other slide that made him go on the other side. I wish he kind of like got something for that, but I don't know if that's because obviously he has a low heat smash. So I think they might have just changed it because of that. But yeah, he doesn't have that. He doesn't have the one that goes on the other side anymore. So let's talk about his just frames, man. Like obviously, I might not get it right the first time and I want to show you how hard it is so I will be keeping in the tries so you can see if I can't if it takes too long then uh, I will just skip but yeah he has one three 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 there we go he now has back one one two Oh my gosh. There we go. Then he has back one plus two. There we go. And four four two. So those are his just frames. But they are they are pretty difficult for someone that has to start out, but Yeah. You can get it done. Um What's the other stuff that I need to talk about? We have so Hitman, is, you can go to Hitman by pressing 3 plus 4. He has Hitman 1, which is pretty fast. It's 12 frames. Hitman 1-1. One, one. Well, not 1-1-1. One, 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 just Hitman 1-1. One, one. He also has 2, which is a big launcher. And also does Tornado Attack. But yeah, just be careful. He also has Power Crush, which is free. With, and high. And then it goes into this attack grab. Oh, sorry. That thing is pretty nice. He then has four, which used to launch in the old games. I'm kind of annoyed that it doesn't launch in this. It kind of gives you this spin effect. I'm not really too happy about that, but yeah. I think, again, like he has a low heat smash and I think they tried to nerf all the majority of his lows. And then he has one plus two, which is kind of like a nice, like a nice 
mid mid check you know so yeah those are the stuff that you could get from hitman and then you've got his throws now he's got his generic throws but then he has the the knee right so this throw you can either use against the wall into forward four one now The reason why I didn't add this in the just frame is because this one is a high. He also has uh, three, four, three, 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 four, 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 four. But I didn't add the, I didn't add that one into the just frame just because I think those ones are a bit more harder. And obviously, four, four, one is your tornado attack, which we was gonna get into in a bit. But yeah. So yeah, I guess what you could use. Up forward one plus two, and then forward four one for your combo. And then you could also do up forward one plus two in the open, and then do forward three plus four like this for your extra damage. So yeah, the the throw does twenty damage. So, but I think it's counting into fact of you doing that on top of it to get like you know the other full team so yeah obviously your combo starters are up forward four down four two four four neutral uh sorry four neutral three four uh for filler you can do you can do back three three for most stuff and then go to misstep don't know if it calls it misstep but yeah it's a, it is a misstep and then obviously you've got stuff like four four two which does tornado I don't even know if I'm even gonna get it like that. Let me try and do it from Blazing Kick. And then you also have obviously forward four one. That does your tornado attack as well. And you also have blazing kick, which is actually kind of funny. You could do two blazing kicks. If I could get it out. I don't know why it's hard on this PS5 pad. So yeah. For Ender, you could do down forward three two, down forward three two three. So safe it up out of this three two three, and it sends them flying. And yeah, I think that is it really in terms of like stuff for his combos. His combos, I know that people are like, oh, but you ain't taught them back back forward loops. But yeah, that is. That is not easy for beginners. And I don't want to teach that just yet. Like, we'll talk about all that stuff in the intermediate side of things, like for combos and stuff like that. I have a strategy when it comes to that, teaching the more difficult characters. And I think teaching them back uh, back two loops was not ideal right now. So yeah, just getting them started is what I'm trying to do. So in terms of that, I think that is pretty much everything. We are going to get into the heat engagers. So... The heat engages he has is down forward 4 4, 4 4 3, 4 4 4. Uh, so I've got to get the just frame version. I don't know how I'm going to do that. Oh, the just frame version is hard. Come on. Let me see. Let me see the timing. So if you. So this is good for me to show you right now, actually. So if you want to get just frame version or per perfect input version of moves, it's best to look at the move list and see the timing. So yeah, look, one, two, and it's that, du, 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 and then delayed. Okay, so now I'm going to try and replicate that. There we go. And I just figured it out just like that, which is pretty, crazy but it's also a very good way if you want to try and find out just frame inputs for moves in the move list all right so the perks from heat is that you can do moves without getting the perfect input but as you can see it does take a bar if you don't get the perfect input you can replenish your bar by having perfect input Restores remaining heat upon perfect input look. So 
Yeah, he's, he could just be restoring heat by just saying marvelous. Yeah, this character is great. He also has back 3 plus 4. Power crush high. And then he has Hitman up forward 3. I mean up 3, sorry. You can do up forward, but yeah, Hitman up 3. Which is a mid. It's a pretty nice mid as well at that. Moving on. In heat, he has he has a heat smash, which is a low. So remember I was telling you about his lows being nerfed, like stuff like this. It's because his heat smash looks exactly like it, right? <laughs> it's at its exact same frames. And the thing with heat smash lows is you cannot low parry heat smashes that are low. So you gotta be careful when characters like that have them. You have to block them and then punish. So yeah, I think that's it in terms of Lee. Like I said, he's execution heavy. And it's like, He's such a fun character because where do you where do you get rewarded with the excellent? You got a damn dude. You could do blazing kick from stuff like that. Like it's just it's just nice. It's a nice touch at it. So he also has an attack parry. So it's, this is for punches. And then if you're successful, you can press four. So it's one plus three or uh, back one plus three or back two plus four. Right. The follow up attack is if it succeeds. He says, beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. <laughs> this character is a twat. No, I'm joking. I like, I like Lee. I think he's a fucking character. But yeah, if you want to check out more stuff, you could go check out Mirio's channel. He is a UK content creator that specializes with the character. Really good, funny, funny guy as well. You check out his streams, check out his YouTube. Uh, me personally, I think he's a very fun character. He is on the, I would say advanced side because obviously the back two loops and then obviously the perfect inputs but he's a very rewarding character and i'm sure that you lot would like to try him out so yeah let me know what you lot think leave a comment in the comment section down below and remember to subscribe take it easy everyone peace